Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Expanded. Let's get straight into it. Okay, so it's Thursday the 11th of fall. We've got Robin working on something it seems. What is she doing? Oh, she's doing a stable. Oh my goodness, I forgot about that. That's very exciting. We've also got some crops to harvest, so let's grab these. Oh, no, let's not fish. And whose birthday is it? It's Jodie's birthday. Are we gifting in this playthrough? I can't ever remember which playthrough I gift to the vanilla characters in. I know Ridge side, I definitely don't because there's way too many characters in that playthrough. But maybe we should gift Jodie something. If I have anything she likes, I'll consider it. <laughs> and today we are mostly going to be working on these little quests. So we have a lot of bombs to make and I really want to try and do some iridium ore at some point. So we've got to work on the bus as well. This one isn't time, so it's okay. This one is. But I do want to do this because I think it's an expanded quest, I believe, because I've never seen it before. So I will be trying to get as many cherry bombs and bombs and stuff we can get. Although we don't actually have the recipes for all the bombs yet. We have the regular bomb and the cherry bomb, but we don't have the mega bomb. So we need to somehow unlock the recipe for it first and then craft a bunch. Okay, they're all watered. We'll go and do our animals. And I think we have a couple of these that we need to donate. Yeah, eggplant. I think the corn. Okay, we've got a bunch to donate. The others I will save for now. Actually, I'll sell them to Pierre because then we can get the money straight away. And I should probably go and buy a couple more seeds for here anyway. Right, let's go and do the animals. And then I guess we're going mining. I think the whole episode is essentially going to be mining because that is the most important. And I also wanted to get a goat at the end of the last episode. So we might do that today as well. We could actually do that right now. Let's hurt all of our chickens. I think we have a duck in our incubator, right? I think we did that last time. We see yeah we've got three days on the duck egg so i don't think we'll see it on this episode but maybe next episode we'll have a new duck which is pretty exciting oh is that our first iridium egg nice our chickens must be really happy at this point okay so let's go and get ourselves a goat be our first little goat hi marnie can i please have a goat okay you can be housed here oh my gosh chuckany chuckany um i don't think i'm gonna go with chuckany okay i don't know what we should call our goat um what about gertha let's call our goat gertha gertha the goat i think that's quite cute let's go for it welcome to the family gertha <laughs> great i'll send little gertha to her new home right away thanks money okay we have no money again so that's great i actually shouldn't have done that because we could have paid off part of the bus today if i hadn't have gotten gertha but hey we need gertha right we need gertha in our lives okay let's go to pierre's and sell these things oh george wants a ruby for 750 that is some good money so we might consider that Right, let's sell all of these and I'm gonna grab what will be done in time. 13 days. These will be done in time. I might just grab some pumpkins, honestly, because they sell for the best, right? So we need eight. I'll just plop them here. Hopefully we don't die with those in our pockets in the mines. I might give Susan a cheese. <gasps> she liked it. Okay, I literally have zero hearts with Susan, which is very sad, honestly, because she is such a cutie. Wonderful to see you, Lil. Buying seeds from Pierre today? Indeed I am, Susan. Wonderful to see Okay, she just keeps saying that. <laughs> <laughs> right, let's head up to the mines then. We've got very important business to attend to. We need to get all the copper and all the iron to make all these bombs. Oh, wait, did we finish the fish bundle? Oh yeah, we did finish the fish bundle last time, right? I forgot about this cutscene. It's odd, I'm not sure what caused this boulder to disappear. I honestly couldn't tell you, Willy. I definitely don't know. This stream is flowing from deep within the mountain. Hey, do you see that glistening in the water? Yes. Whatever could it be? Yes, that's quality ore. Oh, this actually could be helpful for right now since we need a lot. The flow of water must be carrying it out of the mountain. Do any of you ever use the copper pan? I don't think I've ever really seriously used it. You know what this means, right? No? It means we can start panning for ore. He's so excited. Here, I've got an extra pan in my backpack. Why don't you take it? Oh, that's so sweet. Thanks, Willy. If you ever see ore glistening in the water, use that pan and see what you find. Yeah, I literally never use this. <laughs> you received a copper pan. Thanks. We might actually use it though since we're trying to get so much copper and such. I don't think it's just copper that you get from it either, right? Can we see any glistening spots? I just feel like I never see them either. Are they quite rare maybe? I don't see anything glistening right now. This map is just so good for forage, honestly. You could just never go hungry living here. <laughs> okay, let's put away the things we don't actually need. Mining. I don't know why I bought my scythe or my hoe, to be honest. Let's go to the top floors first for copper. Oh, what's this gonna be? Oh, an aquamarine. Nice. We're just gonna try and get as much copper as we want. That is what it needs, right? 
yeah, we just need to drop off cherry bombs. So it doesn't matter where we get it from. Technically, we could just buy them from the dwarf, I guess. But I kind of want to make them myself. When do we actually unlock the mega bomb recipe? Let me just search that quickly. <laughs> okay, we need mining level 8 to unlock it. So what are we currently? We're mining level 6. So it will take us a little while, but it's definitely possible. Just got to try and get all the XP, I guess. Which we should get from breaking ore, right? If we need 30 cherry bombs, we need 30 times 5 amount of copper ore, right? Is it five pieces per cherry bomb? Let me just check. Oh, four pieces and one piece of coal. So we need four times 30. Oh my gosh. Is that 120 pieces of copper ore? I think so. Let me calculate quickly. Let me just calculate that. Yeah, so we need 120 pieces of copper ore. And obviously we need 30 pieces of coal. And then we need 20 times, is it five for the mega bomb? Four again so we need 20 times four and we need 80 iron to complete this so we need a lot <laughs> we need a heck ton okay well we better get a wiggle on then although we can get them from these we could just mine these for the cherry bombs although we rarely get them to be honest also trying to mine as much xp as we can i know that the silver rocks give xp i think and probably breaking ore gives a little bit of xp for mining because obviously we need to unlock level eight i'm just trying to mine as much as we can and get as much xp as we can i don't know the best ways to get mining xp actually oh we got a cherry bomb from that from the little duggy oh we got a ruby here we can send that to george right we had a quest for that i think yeah george wanted a ruby so we can take that to him tomorrow oh we got another cherry bomb honestly maybe we should just brand the duggies oh we got the monster slayer goal nice we should go to jail then maybe we'll do that tomorrow as well i think that was for killing the flies maybe okay it is getting late so i think i am gonna leave now but we managed to get 90 copper ore, so we're like a good way complete. Let me put down these pumpkins as well quickly. Is there any chance we have any speed grow? No, I don't think we do. Wait, can we make enough bombs already? We need 30 cherry bombs. We can make 31, so we've actually done cherry bombs today. We had some copper left in our chest. Okay, we're done with the cherry bombs. They're completed, so tomorrow we need to work on the iron. And then it will be trying to unlock the mega bomb recipe. Oh, we also had two tray bombs, so we've actually got 32 now. <laughs> Let's head to bed for now, though. That was pretty productive. We got the first part done. And we got a goat. <gasps> and we finally got the keg recipe. Oh my gosh, I've been waiting for that. That is so good. We can now make coffee and we can be super fast. And we're getting our horse as well. So we're going to be zooming all over the place. Oh, and we did level up in combat. So it's not actually what we wanted. We wanted mining, but combat's still pretty good. We didn't level up in mining though. That's a shame. Also, we made no money. <laughs> it's a good luck day today though. So hopefully that will help us with our quest for iron. Let's water and do our animals. And then I think we might head to the merchant and to Clint's first to drop off these cherry bombs. And I might also go and see Sophia. Hang on, we've got a horse. <gasps> what do we name our horse? So I've asked in my Discord for any names for my horse. So let's see what they have to say. Okay, it seems like we've settled on the name Soup because our little kitty is called Miso. So we'll have Miso Soup together. I think that's pretty cute. <laughs> that's how you spell soup, right? I didn't name it Soap. Yeah, no, that's right. Soup is spelt like that, right? I get words like load and loud and soup and soap mixed up so much. So I hope I haven't called my horse Soap. I think that's Soup. Oh my God, shall we put my pan on his head? Can you do that? Maybe we should take off our hat. We'll wear the copper pan. <laughs> and we'll put this hat on Miso. <gasps> oh my gosh. Wait, his name's not Miso. He's Soup. <laughs> Look at me and Soup. Oh my gosh, this is so wholesome. I love it. Okay, sorry, we've got work to do. I can't believe we've got our horse. I can't tell you how happy it makes me having a horse in this game. It's so cute. Look at Soup. <laughs> oh, and we've got to meet our goat as well. Hello, Gertha. Gertha's a little bit, a little bit shy, I think. She's sticking to the edge of the coop at the moment. Okay, let's put some cheese on. Oh, and we should go and see Sophia. We haven't visited her in a while. I'm gonna sell these mayos quickly and I'll dump everything in my chests. Wait, I've just realized I've got a rare seed. Shouldn't I planted this? Cause it's autumn. How long does the rare seed take to grow though? Oh, it takes all season to grow. Oh no, we won't be able to plant that. I guess we'll have to do that in our greenhouse when we get it. Okay, what could we take for Sophia? She liked an amethyst, didn't she? Also, I've got to take the ruby to George, too. She liked poppies. She disliked the Nekoite, apparently, and quartz was normal for her. 
Is that all we know so far? Wow, we really haven't given her much that she likes. <laughs> well, I think I'll give her the amethyst. I don't think we've tried that yet. So we'll try that. And now we can go on our horse as well. Look at us flying. Also, we've got maple syrup as well. Also, I really need to add paths around here because we're getting so much debris in between these trees. Hello, merchant. What do you have today? Do we need any of this stuff? I don't think so. No, nothing's really all that useful, I don't think. Thank you, merchant, but no thanks. <laughs> she was useless again. Also, I must remember to make some kegs since we got the recipe. Hi, Sophia. Would you like an amethyst? You're sweet, thanks. Four hearts. We might have already had that. Have you been to Zuzu City's convention center? I think she's told me this before. Okay, bye. Right, let's go to George and over to Clint's as well. Right, let's drop these bombs off at Clint's. Oh, wait, no, Clint's the other one. Wait, where do I need to put these? Marlon's chest. Oh, this is a Marlon quest. Oh, okay. Clint is the Iridium, isn't he? That makes sense. Okay, let's go to George and then we'll go to Marlon's instead then. It was George who wanted a ruby, right? Here we go. Yay. Hey, so you saw the ad I posted. I really appreciate it. It's a little something for your trouble. Gave us quite a bit, to be honest. 750 gold. That is quite tasty. Thank you. Right, we do need to get a move on because we've got a lot of iron to farm today. I can't believe we finally got a horse. Look at us just riding through the valley. Hello, Marlon. Where can I put this? Oh, in this chest back here, maybe. Okay, I can put the bombs in. Heck yeah. Also, I need to go and talk to Jill, don't I? Oh, we got the insect head. Thank you. Freya. Freya? She's new. Hi, love. We should go adventuring together sometime. Oh my gosh, she looks so cute. She looks like a mix between Robin and Leah. I want to be a friend. Can I actually go adventuring with her? That would be really cute if we could mine together and it was kind of like co-op mines and she helped me. Where's she going? Who are you, Freya? Tell me more about yourself. Sorry that I keep wielding my weapon at you, but I'm just really curious. Okay, let's go mining. Okay, ice floors today. Oh my gosh, I'm having the worst luck at finding ladders today. Even though it's a better luck day. There it is. We're not getting a ton of iron either. Ooh, we got a jade from that slime. Nice. Ooh, there's a nice clump of iron. That's what we're looking for. And a freebie ladder. That's what we've been after this whole time. We haven't had any, like, good clumps yet. Wait, I think we have enough. We have 83. So we need to craft 20 bombs, was it? Oh, wait. No, we don't have enough. Huh? Oh, wait. How can we only craft... Oh, we don't have enough coal. I think we have more at home, though. So we've got 12 so far. We need to get some coal. Okay, it's midnight. So I think I'm going to head back. And we should have some coal at home, hopefully. And then we just need to level up, which is going to be a little tricky because we don't have much control over that, I suppose. I mean, we do. We just need to farm our XP a little bit. Let's see if we have enough coal. <gasps> we do. Oh my gosh. I think we've got enough, everyone. We've done it. We've got 20 now. Okay, so we just need to get mega bombs. Let's put on some more melons. Okay, we're definitely running out of chest space as well. Let's head to bed. And in the morning, we'll drop off those bombs as well. <gasps> we leveled up in mining. Okay, so we're level seven. Do we just keep mining for XP? What is the best way to get mining XP? How much XP do we need between level seven and level eight? That's the question. If we farmed diamonds or something, would that give us a load of XP. Get quite a bit of XP from a ruby node, it seems. Diamond nodes give you 150 XP, it seems. If I'm reading this right, which honestly I'm probably not. So maybe we should just try and farm for diamonds. But we are level 7, so that's pretty cool. We did level up. We didn't make too much money, but let's, let's face it, we're not really working on money right now. We have spent this whole episode in the mines. I hope that's okay with y'all. <laughs> it is a bad luck day, so I don't think we would get too many diamonds if we were to try and diamond farm. Oh, but we do have a cranberry harvest and we have an ancient fruit oh my goodness that's pretty cool and we have fairy roses should i pick these I feel like i should pick like maybe just three of them and i could always put it in a seed maker should i put one in the seed maker i'll do the silver quality one because i think you have more chance of getting fairy seeds oh we are getting fairy seeds i wonder how many we'll get and we've got fairy rose honey that's so cool i think that will sell for a bit i'm gonna take a fairy rose to sophia because apparently that's her favorite right and i think we need to sort out these chests a little bit maybe we could make some money if we clean these out i'm just really desperate to get the mega bomb <laughs> maybe we could go to clint's and open some of these geodes as well let's plant down these fairy rose seeds we got three perfect i think i'm just gonna need to make a new chest just to dump things in we will chest organize eventually just don't know what to do with all this stuff right now what do we 
need for kegs as well. We need oak resin, iron bar, copper bar, and wood. I wonder if we have any of that. Okay, we don't have an iron bar, but we could make just one, a singular iron bar. We might be able to make a singular keg. <laughs> and then we need oak resin. We do have some oak resin and we do have wood. So we can make a singular keg, which is good. We can make coffee from it, so that's all right. And I think I am gonna go and open these geodes as well today. And I think we are just gonna try and mine XP as much as we can as well for the rest of the day. So I know we spent the entire episode in the mines, but it's for a good cause. We're trying to work on this quest and I think it's worthwhile, you know? And especially since we're gonna go to Skull Cabin soon to try and get the Iridium as well for Clint's quest, it makes sense to try and get our mining skill up, you know? We're gonna need bombs, so it makes sense, right? Right? <laughs> we do need to make some money for the bus repair as well though. There's lots to do. <laughs> Only one more day left for our new duck as well. Okay, we got the iron bar. Let's make our first ever keg. Oh my gosh, we can actually finally have coffees. This is perfect all these coffee beans just sitting here you know let's plop it next to the shipping bin for now and just make a butt ton of coffee from it <laughs> oh what am i doing i'm getting me horse <laughs> i hope i can gift sophia today oh no i've given her two already that is so annoying why did i give her that amethyst it wasn't even a loved gift i have to wait until monday but at least we got the fairy rose though something she's gonna love okay we'll go over to clint's i think first no we'll go to Pierre's so we have more inventory space to open the geodes. I wish you didn't have to get off your horse when you clicked on the bin. She could do it whilst you were on your horse. That'd be so much more efficient. Harvey needs quartz. I can definitely get you some quartz, Harvey. Hello, Pierre. Can you buy my cranberries, please? And my mayonnaise and my fairy rose honey. Cheers. We could get started on the bus, to be fair. We should be able to do at least a couple of them. A couple of the cheaper bundles, maybe? I don't know if we've done any, actually. Let me check. Yeah, we haven't done any, so we could at least do this one, or maybe this one. Okay, process geodes. Please give me some good stuff, Clint. And the last one, piece of coal. Okay, we got some good stuff, I think. Let's go and give them to Gunther. Oh, we only got one thing to donate. <laughs> okay, maybe we didn't do that well, then. May as well get started on this vault. How many can we do? Should we do the smallest one? Oh, we got chocolate cake from that. Nice. And maybe we'll do the 5k one as well, which we get some fertilizer. Okay. So we just got those two left to do, which we need 35k in total. So uh, I feel like we could, you know, definitely make some progress with it. I feel like we could have that done fairly soon, you know? Okay, let's drop these bombs off at Marlon's as well. So we're going to be trying to get as many diamonds as possible, but I doubt we're going to get any, to be honest. Okay, just the mega bombs left to go. And then we'll have to get all the ingredients to make the mega bombs as well. So there's a lot to do but it is only 10 mega bombs so it's a little bit better it says that diamonds can spawn on any floor past 50 okay well this is not going to plan <laughs> there are enemies all over me <gasps> there's a diamond oh my gosh no way there's a diamond on this floor how did we get that lucky so that's 150 xp then oh my gosh there's so many enemies to get there though 150 xp baby if i read it right <laughs> honestly i just feel like we should just mine basically and just see how much we can do in a day wondering if I should go to like floor 80 instead. Also trying to collect anything that we can sell for money for the bus as well. And I'm guessing I'm just going to do iron nodes as well because they give you a little bit of XP I think. And we are going to need some iron for upgrading our tools and such for skull caverns. Oh there's an aquamarine up here that must give you a little bit if it's a gem right? I really don't know if I'm doing this right but I'm trying. Okay I'm thinking I might go a little bit deeper in the mines like level 80 because surely if we're breaking gold both we need that for mega bombs but also surely that's going to give us more xp because it's further down right that would make sense to me i don't know though i don't know anything in this game i am weak down here though i feel oh my gosh these take ages to die i need a better sword okay actually i changed my mind i don't like these floors no oh stop stop it stop <laughs> I need to eat cheese. <laughs> I think I might stick to the iron floors, actually. Let's go back to the iron floors until I get a better sword. I ain't going down there. They're horrid. Oh my gosh, this was a bad decision. I'm wondering how many dwarf scrolls we have, because what if we just got the mega bombs that way? Could be worthwhile checking out, actually. Oh, I see a ruby in the bottom corner as well. That could give some good experience, hopefully. I don't know how much experience we actually need between levels for this but we've had an aquamarine a diamond and a ruby now so we should be getting close right nah don't think we're gonna do that don't think we're gonna do that floor <gasps> there's another diamond node 
oh my gosh, I'm actually getting diamonds somehow. I feel like the game is just taking pity on me at this point. Thank you, game. Right, it's midnight, so I think I'm going to head back now. I definitely don't think we got enough XP to level up, unfortunately. <laughs> but we tried. We tried the best we could. Oh, we haven't donated this scroll, actually. Oh, and our coffee's done, too. That's exciting. We did get some nice iron ore, and we've got loads of gold ore, too. We might start smelting some of this iron ore, because we're going to need to upgrade our tools, aren't we? Let me just check how many of the dwarf scrolls we've actually found. Okay, it seems like we've only got two of the dwarf scrolls and I don't even know if we've donated them But we need to get the other two before we can even talk to the dwarf So I guess we are kind of far off that to be honest just gonna put on another cup of coffee so it's ready for when we wake up <laughs> and then I'll head to bed. I don't think we made any money again today. Although our money right now is kind of satisfying. <laughs> Can't lie. Did we level up? No, we didn't. We must be closer than we were, right? Oh, we've got a recipe and it's the merchant. Trout soup. Okay. And it's a good luck day. So another mining day when we come back, I think. And our pumpkins are ready. That's exciting. I do think I'm going to wrap up there. Thank you so much for watching. I'm sorry I spent the whole episode in the mines, but it was a lot of fun. I had a lot of fun at least. When we come back, I'm sure we'll be in the mines again because we need to get these quests complete. I am committed to them. <laughs> Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode and I will see you in the next one. Bye everyone.